What could Romeo be thinking? He doesn't understand what he's done. I can feel it. Somewhere, in the foundation of this tower, it has begun to manifest. The ritual that Romeo was talking about. Could we use it to stop Ball? No. He's wrong. You can't hope that such a thing would be enough to suppress the Gate of Memories. I'm afraid that it's already too late. Even if you tried to make Ergo take more of Baal's power, that would only delay the inevitable. He will awaken sooner or later. Can you open a way there? To the foundations of Arcane, where the gate is? Yes. Are you two really going to face it? That thing. It has many names, for a monstrosity that never should have had one. When he appeared for the first time, I named him Baal, which means the Master. It is a door, a living gate to a hell beyond our understanding, a shadow made of the pain, the suffering, and the hate of everything that exists. A gate to our darkest memories. It's not a god. It's the thing that even gods fear. You mean that he's more powerful than me? Yes, Ergo, it is. You can't stop it. Even if it has not manifested in the world yet, even if it is just a mindless fragment of its true self, you can't stop it. Neither can I. Soon its gate will open, and with that, it will be the end of everything. Let's go, baby. What are you going to do? You should know, Lady Ellie and I. He really loves to do things that others say are impossible for him. Lady Ellie and I, aren't you going to chastise me? It doesn't matter anymore. They can't win. The door can't be closed. I have destroyed the very world that I wanted to save. <laughs> you know, Romeo, I have looked into the heart of darkness, and there was only hope.